Hi everyone, thanks for joining us tonight. As part of his local jobs and projects tour, Governor Walls visited the Brainerd Lakes Air Tanker Base Gate this morning. The governor has been touring projects across the state to consider including in his bonding proposal for the 2022 legislative session. Reporter Nick Rossini has the story. At 11 a.m. this morning, Governor Walls touched down at the Brainerd Lakes Airport, greeted by members of the DNR, to show the need for an upgrade to the Brainerd Air Tanker base facility. We're here today in Brainerd and with the DNR and Paul Lundgren, the, the fire section manager, will talk a little bit about this, um, about the capacity that Minnesota has to fight wildfires. And this is obviously a, a key issue this summer when we saw the worst wildfires in half a century, closing of the Bondi waters for the first time in 48 years, the loss of houses, um, entire communities being evacuated at times because of how bad this was. In total, the bonding request is $7.8 million for wildlife aviation infrastructure. Here at the Brainerd Lakes Airport, $3.5 million is being requested. These facilities go directly to supporting um, the operations that provide critical protection to citizens across the state of Minnesota and supporting our wildfire, our wireland firefighters on the ground. Um, with these facilities, the aircraft, the operations uh, provided, we can respond quickly, we can respond safely, and effectively. That includes replacing existing facilities for workspaces up to 30 people. Currently, the air tanker base uses two mobile home units and sheds that are past their use. Upgrades to airports make a huge economic difference as far as a convenience uh, for citizens, and so this is the time to start talking about that. I would encourage folks to uh, to go online, look at these requests. We put them all online. You get to see what we're requesting for and, and um, what the costs of these are. Especially here in the Brainerd Lakes area, where tourism is a major part of the economy. I heard these folks talking about this summer. We had a lot of folks staying in hotels here, spending money in restaurants that were here fighting fires. Um, those are a benefit to the community. This is, as I said, a great airport facility. It's critical up here in uh, this part for folks coming in both business wise and, and tourism wise and to co-locate this here just makes sense. If approved, Lundgren says they will be ready to start construction as soon as possible. Reporting from the Brainerd Lakes Regional Airport, Nick Ursini, Lakeland News. The governor will submit his request to the legislature on the 2022 bonding proposal in January. Lakeland News is member supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.